right. That's right. God didn't make you to share your plumbing. That's it. With another man. That's right. God didn't make you for that. No. I don't care if you're a homosexual doctor, a homosexual judge, a homosexual attorney, a homosexual journalist, a homosexual teacher, a homosexual nurse, a homosexual politician. We're not talking about your natural job skill. That's right. We're talking about your physical indulgence. Your sexual behavior. That's right. That's what, glory to God, the word of God is talking about here. That's right. That's not what Moses said. In the book of Leviticus chapter 18 and verse 22. Follow me. Thou shalt not lie with mankind. Thou shalt not. Not lie with mankind. As thou shalt not lie thou shalt with not mankind. As with womankind. In the same manner you lie with a woman. It is abomination. Amen. 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 I don't understand what that means, Pastor Jenner. Break it down. Notice what the language of the Bible. Thou shalt not lie with mankind. Shouldn't lie with mankind. As with womankind. As. As with as womankind. With womankind. It is abomination. In raw terms, you should not be trying to have sex with a man. That's right. The way you have it with a woman. That's right. And in the book of Leviticus, chapter 20. You should not be trying to have sex with a man the way you have it with a woman, Miss Up. That's right. Amen. You should not be doing that. That's right. You should not. Yes. Somebody said, Do you believe in gay rights? That depends on what right you're talking about. Do gays got a right to eat, folks? Yes. Talk back to me. Yes. Talk back to me. Yes. Do gays got a right to sleep? Yes. They got a right to have a job? Yes. They got a right to have an education? Yes. They got a right to be a doctor? Yes. They got a right to be a chef? Yes. That's right. But do they got the right to have sex with each other? No. What? No. What? No. What? No. Now in the book of Leviticus chapter 20. Are you listening at this? And verse 13. It's in your Bible, Catholics. Follow me. In Mr. Francis, get off your... Pope throne. <laughs> Come on down to the common chair that I sit in. That's right. I want you and I, you say you are an apostle. That's what they say. I have declared to the world that God made me an apostle. <laughs> so come on. Come on, Mr. Apostle. Because no apostle in that Bible talk like you, Francis. No. No apostle in the Bible talk like you, Francis. That's right. Come on, Francis. That's I'm right. calling you out. Here's one apostle to another. <laughs> I'm calling you out. I want you and I to get the Bible in the public, in front of the cameras. I want you to justify what you said by the Bible. That's right. Viewers, understand this. Let me just break up the myth about the Pope. Yeah. One, he is not next to God. Right. Two, his word is not gospel. Yeah. Only God's word is gospel. So you sinners out there that are happy now because you got Pope Francis on your side, that happiness will be short-lived. Oh yeah. Because what he did was gave you an invitation to be an abominable people and to be cast into hell. That's right. 
You say Peter was your first pope. But Peter never preached that garbage. You said Paul was a pope. Paul ain't never. Let, I'll show you what Paul preached. That's right. Give me, let's go right to Rome. Right to Rome. Right I to Rome. Right to Rome. Right to Rome. I want, I want the Pope and every Catholic, every diocese bishop, every archbishop, every Catholic that are watching. I'm challenging the Pope of Rome for an international televised discussion. I want your Pope. Listen to Pastor Jennings. I want your Pope. I don't want an altar boy. I don't want a weak priest. I don't want a cheap archbishop. I want your Pope. If he got confidence and that trash, listen, I'm declaring to the world what he said was trash. That's right. What the Pope said, that it's nothing wrong to have same-sex marriages outside of church, He's a blasphemer. He's a promoter of abomination. He called God a lie. He called the Bible a lie. And as a result, I'm calling him a liar. That's right. You Catholics, you Catholics, you shouldn't take this. You shouldn't take this. Don't take this lying down. Get up. Get up, I said. That's right. Write a letter to your pope. Tell him I said I want to face that hypocrite. He blasphemed. Amen. The news was interrupted because the pope had a blasphemy message. Yes. Why don't you interrupt the news with this? That's right. Why don't you play this? That's right. Here's a little man in Philadelphia in America challenging the big old pope. <laughs> Way in Rome, Italy. Now, I'm going to travel to Rome, right to Rome in the Bible That's right. with the book of Romans. In the book of Romans, Listen. chapter 1, and we'll start at verse 18. Listen at this. For the wrath of God is revealed from heaven, the wrath of God is revealed from heaven against all ungodliness. Against everything that's not right. And unrighteousness of men and what? who hold the truth in unrighteousness, uh -huh. because that which may be known of God is manifest in them. What is For God hath showed it unto them. God showed it unto them. For the invisible things of him from the creation of the world are clearly seen. Yes. Being understood by the things that are made, even his eternal power and God is. All right. So that they are without excuse. Yes. Because that when they knew God, they glorified. When they do God, God, they don't recognize them as God. Neither were thankful, Not thankful. but became vain, vain. in their imagination. Wait a minute. Amen. How in the world the Pope going to say it's all right for same sex to get married outside the church? You are vain in your imagination. Right. You are vain in it. Became vain. It's, it's a sin for you to even go to the wedding. It's a sin to give a gift to a same-sex marriage. That's right. It's a sin for you to participate in a same-sex marriage. That's right. It's a sin if you're a photographer to even photograph a same-sex marriage. That's right. It's a sin if you're a musician to even play for a same-sex marriage. That's right. It's a sin if you're a songster to even sing at a same-sex marriage. That's right. It's a sin if you're a preacher to perform a same-sex marriage. That's right. It's a sin if you're a seamstress to make a gown or a dress for a same-sex marriage. That's it's right. a sin if you are baker to bake a cake for a same-sex marriage. That's right. That's right. No man mm -hmm. established the law of marriage. That's right. The law of marriage, God installed it. That's right. God enforced it. That's right. God established it. That's right. And every man that come along today must hold the law of marriage in the same manner that God established it yesterday. That's right. Why? God said, I'm the same today and yesterday. Glory. Thank God, hallelujah, and forevermore. These preachers are scared to speak out. Yeah. Even, even they gave T.D. Jakes an interview. He flopped around. Well, there, 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 there's, there's different theologies about homosexuality. There's, there's some theology says one thing, and there's some theology... <laughs> Uh, 
Are you getting what I'm talking? God said it. We believe it. If God said it, how we feel about it? If God said it, how do we feel about it? If God said it, how do the church feel? Amen. We don't believe no pope. That's right. Listen, Catholics. Your pope is still a sinner yeah. himself. He ain't repented and been baptized in the name of Jesus Christ. He don't have the blessed Holy Ghost speaking in other tongues. Right. He's just a sinner with red shoes. That's it. God, God made me like the Apostle Paul. Oh, yes. And I'm declaring to the world if an angel come from heaven yeah. and bring another gospel that different from what the apostles preach, let the angels be cussed. That's right. To us, the Pope is not the mouth of God. Yeah. He's nothing but a delirious old <laughs> sinner. That's it. Who's promoting blasphemy and promoting abomination. That's right. All right, William, let's go to Rome. Listen to that this and read quick. Romans 1 and now we're at verse 21. All right. But became vain in their imagination. They became vain Amen. in their imagination. And their foolish heart was darkened. Wait a minute. What kind of heart do the Pope have? Foolish heart. A fool heart. The foolish heart. Of a fool. heart. Uh -huh. Was darkened. Professing themselves to be wise, they became fools. Oh, he thought what he said was so wise. Yeah. So just tell me, what made you come to that conclusion hmm. that it's all right for two men to kiss outside of St. Peter's Cathedral. <laughs> That's right. What made you come to that conclusion? That's right. That it's all right for a man to knock up another man as long as he don't do it in St. Peter's Cathedral. <laughs> Amen. Amen. That's the devil out of hell. Professing themselves to I be wise. I told you when these religion, I've been telling you for years, when a man started religion, that man justified every piece of trash under the sun. Amen. All right. But became vain in their imaginations. They, their imagination is very vain. And their foolish heart was darkened. Their fool heart is in darkness. Profess being covered by the devil. Professing themselves to be, wise, to be wise, they became they fools. They became fools. And changed the glory of the uncorruptible God. So what? Into an image made like to corruptible man. Yes. And the birds and four-footed beasts and creeping things. What is it? Wherefore? Wherefore? God also gave God them up. Also, here we write in Rome. Amen. Glory to God, him, the message given from God to the Apostle Paul, right. born in Tarsus in the city of Cilicia, the one whom the Lord stopped. Blessed be God. Amen. And a light shined from heaven right. above the brightness of the sun and knocked them down to the earth. And God let him know that I'm Jesus, yeah. whom you crucified. It's hard for thee to kick That's against the brick. Amen. But go to the street that is called straight, and it shall be told you what you must do. Ananias, right. baptize him. That's God. And laid hands on him that he may receive the sight. That's right. Paul, amen, received the baptism of the Holy Ghost and went straightway, yeah. preaching Jesus was the Christ. Yeah. That same Paul now is down in Rome. That's right. Blasting the Roman foolishness back to hell Wherefore, and letting them know what God says. Wherefore? God also gave them up. God! God also gave them up to uncleanness. No, 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 no. God accepted them in their uncleanness. God also gave them up to uncleanness. God accepted them in their uncleanness. God also gave them up to uncleanness. You know, you know, you weak, timid, scared Christians, you scared of this kind of preacher. Amen. Right away you said, you see that? That man is full of anger. Where's your love? <laughs> He's full, but yet they won't say that about the Pope. Oh no, that man can get up and justify same-sex marriage as nobody said. Yeah, he's he's bad. He's wrong. <laughs> they say the journalists would say the Pope expressed it in such a loving way. Yes, a loving do. way. The journalists would all get together in various screens. Well, uh, uh, what do you say about it, uh, Mr. Makuba? Well, I, I, I think the Pope expressed it so well. He <laughs> articulated it well. He uh, did it so nobody of no color, no race can be offended. Uh, what do you say about it, Mr. Williams? Oh, I, I, I must agree with Mr. Hukuba. Um, it's just the way the Pope said it. And, 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 then, and, then, and, then, and then the Pope said a key thing outside of church. Outside. See, outside of church. Yeah. That lets you know how, how considerate 
The Pope is. The Pope is the devil out of hell. That's right. You can dress it up. That's right. Dress it up all you want. Yep. God made Adam and Eve. That's right. That's what God made. That's right. Now I got married, I married a woman. <laughs> if I didn't marry a woman, how in the world we gonna have seven kids? How? When I saw that 14 year old girl jumping rope and saw all them legs, that was a girl I looked at. <laughs> Amen. That was a, if, that was, if that was a boy jumping, I wouldn't pay his ashy knees no mind. No way. Am I right, I said? That's right. I wouldn't even turn my back. That's right. Thank God, but when I got out that car and saw all them legs, thighs, hair flowing, and all momentum slowed down. <laughs> Amen. The glory to God, I had to say, hallelujah. <laughs> I ain't going to say that looking at some man. No way. Am I right, I said? Amen. Got to be a child of the lowest part of hell. Oh, yeah. Claim you a preacher and then say, there's nothing wrong with same sex outside, outside of, of the church. And now I guarantee little uh, priests and little archbishops don't sit around with red hats <laughs> and red and white aprons and agree. To abomination. That's right. Any priest agree to it, you are a sinner. Amen. Any Catholic bishop agree to it, you are a sinner. That's right. Any nun agree to it, you are a sinner. That's right. Here, yeah, Pastor Jenner's now. What are you going to do about it? I'm mm -hmm. calling for your Pope. I'm calling for your Pope. He's wanted. Red shoes and all. <laughs> That's right. Come on, son. Romans 1, now we're at verse 24. Amen. Wherefore, God also gave them up to God uncleanness. God gave them up to uncleanness. Through the lust of their own hearts. That's the lust of their own heart. That ain't the lust of God. That's right. That ain't the desire of God. That's the desire of your own heart. That's right. And to dishonor their own bodies. They dishonor their own body. Between themselves. When a man is with a man, you're dishonoring your body. Mm -hmm. When a man is with a man, you're dishonoring your body. That's right. When you perform same-sex marriages, that's dishonor. To dishonor their own bodies. Two men standing there and some dumb, ignorant, hell-deserving so-called preacher or judge going to say, I pronounce you partners for life. My no, Lord. that's abomination with the abomination. That's right. That's right. Get me? Wherefore God also gave them up to uncleanness through God the lust of their own hearts. To uncleanness through the lust of your own heart. To dishonor their own bodies between themselves. To dishonor your own body between themselves. Who change the Who truth change of God. the truth of God. Into a lie. Hold it. Hmm. Truth of God. The truth of God. Let's read the truth of God. Now Amen. in the book of Tobet chapter 8. I want to show you the truth of God about this. In the book of Tobet chapter 8 and verse 6. That's what? Thou madest Adam. Thou madest Adam. And gavest him Eve. And gave him Eve. His wife. His wife. For an helper and stay. Of them came mankind. No. Of who? Thou madest Adam and gavest him Eve for his wife for an helper and stay. Of them came mankind. Two men can't have babies. That's right. Two women on their own can't have babies. That's right. But look how corrupt society is now. Two men to get married, two women to get married, then they go adopt children. Yeah. So they can pass that spirit down from generation to generation. That's right. Two men walking around holding the hands of a little boy. Yeah. Thinking, putting that corruption in the boy's mind that you don't have to be with a girl. That's right. You got two daddies. No, you don't. That's right. You got two sinners. Amen. All children that are watching. Go ahead, man. Go ahead. All children Go ahead, man. that are watching and your daddy is married to another man, yeah. your daddy is evil in the eyes of God. That's right. I don't care if you don't like it. Okay. All children that got two mamas yeah. 
and your mama sleep with another mama. Yeah. Your two mama actions are evil, That's right. wicked, in the eyes of God. That's right. In the book of Leviticus chapter now, 20. Now, 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 you can get upset with Pastor Jennings and say I'm gay bashing. If you say I'm gay bashing, you television stations, you radio stations, and you internet stations, if you say I'm gay bashing, then take all Bibles and burn them. That's right. Take all Bibles and get rid of them. That's right. Because what I'm saying is in that Bible. That's right. Listen. In the book of Leviticus chapter 20 and at verse 13. Leviticus 20, 13. If a man also lie with if mankind. If a man lie with mankind. As he lieth with a as woman. As he lie with a woman. Both of them. Both. Have committed an abomination. Both have committed an abomination. An abomination. They shall surely be put they to shall death. Surely be put to death. Their blood shall their be upon blood, them. Their blood. Their blood shall be upon them. Shall be upon them. That's right. That's how bad God hated. That's right. He said you shall be put to death. Put but to Pastor Dennis, are you saying kill now? No. no. I can't kill you physically now, but there's another way to kill. That's right. Thank God the Bible said you killed all, all the, the day, day long. long. Yeah. In the Old Testament, they killed you by taking away your natural life. In the New Testament, you are killed by the word of God killing your desire. That's right. Killing the way you think. Killing the way you feel. Killing the way you love. That's right. That's right. That's In the Old Testament, they took a sword yeah. and cut you. In the New Testament, New Testament, I come with the sword. That's right. Which is the word of God, word of God. to sever ties right. between two men. That's right. Amen. Are right, you listening to the old man? Back in Romans chapter 1 and verse 25. Says what? Who changed the truth of God into a lie. You want to change the truth. Mm. Truth is Adam and Eve. That's right. The lie is Adam and Steve. <laughs> Amen. Truth is Adam and Eve. Yeah. Lie is Adam and Steve. In Genesis you, chapter 2 and verse 23. Listen at this. Genesis 2 and verse 23. Right, is it? And Adam said, this is now bone of my bones. Bone of my bones. And flesh of my flesh. Flesh of my flesh. She. He. She. He. She. He. She. Read that right, William. She. He. She. She what? She shall be called woman. She shall be called woman because she was taken out of man. No. A man was taken out of a man. She shall be called woman because she was taken out of man. Amen. Where did the other man come from? That's right. That's right. Therefore. This is Bible here. Therefore. You see, a lot of folk don't want to read this. No, no. They say right away the homosexual community said, well, see, Pastor Jennings, none of us wrote the Bible. The Bible is only written by heterosexuals mm. or male chauvinistic men who had their own opinion. They don't know what it's like to be one of us. I don't want to know what it's like to be one of you. <laughs> That's, right. That's right. That's right. God. <laughs> That's right. That's right. No straight man mm -hmm. wrote the scriptures on his own. Knowing this first. I want you to know this first. Give chapter and verse. Second Peter chapter wait, wait, one. Wait, wait, what, what book you in? Second Peter. Oh, Peter. 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 The, 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 the so-called first pope of the Catholics. Second Peter. All right, Francis. That's right. Hey, Francis. That's right. Francis. <laughs> Amen. Francis, I said. <laughs> Amen. We want to go to your first pope. First pope. Give chapter and verse of the so-called first pope of the Catholic Church and hear what he said. Second Peter chapter 1, we're at verse 20. That's what? Knowing this first. He said, I want you to know this first. That no prophecy no of, prophecy the, scripture of the, scripture the scripture is of any private interpretation. Nobody spoke it on their own. Nobody come up with a conclusion of the meaning of their own. Nobody gave their own opinion. For the prophecy came not in the old time. The prophecy came not in old time. By the will of man. By man's own will. But holy men of God speak. Well, wait a minute. What kind of men were they, William? Holy men of God speak. How? As they were moved by the Holy Ghost. All right, Mr. Francis. Amen. Who moved you? <laughs> That's right. To tell the world right. same sex marriages is all right outside of church. Amen. Who moved you to say it? Amen. Because your first pope said, Holy men of God speak. Holy men of God speak. As they were moved. As they was moved. By the Holy Ghost. By the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. Who moved you? Huh? 
Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Word that God the same thing that moved Peter is moving me. That's right. Yeah. That's right. That's why I agree with the apostles and what they said. That's right. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. When you got the same spirit they had, you got to agree with them. That's right. You just have to do it. Amen. What did he say? Back in uh, Romans chapter 1 and verse 25. All right. Who changed the truth of God into a lie uh -huh. and worshiped and served the creature more than the creator. Bless forever. Amen. For this cause For God this gave reason, them up unto vile God affections. gave them up. Now. Vile. Now God labels the affection. Vile affection. He's labeling the feeling. Vile affections. He's laboring the affections that same sex have to each other. Vile affections. Not at no time did he say it's loving. No. Vile. Not at all. No. What do God call it? For this cause God gave them up unto vile affections. Vile affections. For even their women. Even their women. He changed the natural use into that which is against nature. The natural use is woman with the man. <laughs> That's right. That which is unnatural. That's right. A woman with the woman trying to make a baby and then going to try to get married. Right. And it's amazing. They, even homosexuals have their own channel. That's right. On mm. cable. They have their own channel. <laughs> There's cool. a LGBTQRSTUVWXYZ network. <laughs> My Lord. Have their own network. Amen. Now they got more gay cartoons for children. My Lord, my Lord. Gay cartoons for children. My Lord. When I came up, we used to watch Sesame Street. <laughs> the gay community kidnapped Ernie <laughs> and Bert. That's right. And now, on Sesame Street of today, yeah. Ernie and Bert are two homosexuals. My Lord, my Lord. Preacher. That's right. That's right. How in the world are you gonna get that boy to pull his pants up in front of another boy telling him, Timmy, you better stop. Pull up your pants, boy. You don't you don't, you don't do that. You don't you don't do that, Timothy. Dish, 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 dish. That's right. Dish, dish. You don't do that. You two are boys. Yeah. Yes. Amen. You tell Timothy, hey! That's right. That's right. <laughs> you don't pull your pants right, up, man. boy. Go ahead. I have you where you can't sit out. That's right. Timothy will get the message. Yes, he will. That's right. Amen. Let's go back to Rome, son. Everybody all right? Back in Romans chapter 1 and verse 26. Listen at this. For this cause God gave them up unto vile affection. Yes. For even their women did change their natural use into that which is against nature. Uh -huh. And likewise also the men. Likewise also the men, like you... Dirty Harry, when he was here. That's right. That's right. Dirty Harry said he was under the anointing when he was with his partner. You know the devil had him so deceived. Deceived. I mean, that's like deep deception. Amen. He said he felt the anointing of God where he was with his male partner. That's not only blaspheme, that's trying to belittle God. That's right. That's right. 
But when you will, when you with your wife, you don't need no anointing for that. No. Huh? No. Oh no, I don't need the Holy Ghost to come <laughs> upon me to be with my wife. No. Uh uh. Oh, not no. at all. No, no. I didn't feel the moving of God when I first saw her at 14, and I just left church. <laughs> huh? Amen. When I just left church, I wasn't under the anointing. When I saw her jumping rope, I, I wasn't speaking in tongue. That's right. That's right. Huh? Amen. You see, I'm a realist. I wasn't speaking in tongues, and I just left church. Amen. I left a prayer meeting. I came out of prayer. <laughs> I came out of prayer and saw her over there. That's right. And old dirty trifling Harry. Amen. Had the audacity to say that his uh sexual activity was so much involved with this partner, My the Lord. Spirit of the Lord came upon him. My you Lord. know you got to go to hell. Oh, yes. You deserve to go to hell. That's right. Go and belittle God and try to make God like wicked, like the human family. That's right. What's wrong with you preachers mm. that you won't stand up for God? Amen. You love money that much? Yeah. How is it y'all sold out oh, around yeah. the world? That's right. That's right. Pope, Pope come in town. Yeah. Every so-called denomination. Yeah. They go see him. That's right. Like someone great came in town. That's right. The circus came in town. <laughs> Amen. Pope come in town. Apostolic bishops go kiss his hand. Yeah. Pentecostal bishops kiss his hand. Non-denominational bishops kiss his hand. Yeah. Baptist bishops, Mormon bishops, Presbyterian, That's Lutheran, right. Catholic, mayors, governors, That's black, right. white, celebrities. Yes. Woe unto you when all men shall speak well of you. Look, my time is getting away. Amen. Finish up Romans, Romans and get the 18th chapter of Revelation. I have to get that. Yes. Hey Amen. The clock is ticking and clock I got to get ticking. busy. That's right. Come on, son. Romans 1, now we're at verse 27. Yeah. And likewise also the men, leaving the natural use of the woman. Leaving the natural use of the woman. Burned in their lusts one toward another. Wait a minute. Amen. 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 A man look at a man. Same plumbing. <laughs> Only difference is right. one may be fat. One may be tall, one may be short, one may be skinny, same plumbing. Right. No hips. No hips. No curves. That's right. Just a totem pole. <laughs> Amen. How in the world are you going to burn looking at that? Burned in their lust one toward another. But viewers, the Pope now mm. says it's all right. Right. As long as you're a sinner outside of the Catholic Church, mm. you can burn. It's all right to burn and have your own kind. My Lord. That's what the false prophet Pope says. That's right. But listen to what the true prophet says. And likewise also the men leaving the natural use of the woman. The men leave the natural use of the woman. Burned in their lusts one toward another. Let's see how plain the Bible make it. Men with men working that which is unseemly. No, men with men doing the will of God. Men with men working that which is unseemly. Men with men doing God's agenda. Men with men working that which is unseemly. Whether you're in church or out. That's right. When a man is with a man, Amen. what does the word of God call it? Men with men working that which is unseemly. It's unseemly. That's right. It's wrong. That's right. That's why I said Pope Francis is a liar out of hell. Amen. Listen at the truth of God now. Amen. Pope Francis is a lie from the pits of hell. That's right. Come on, you Catholic church. Jump on the truth of God. We would like to take you for a ride. Oh, yes. I'm issuing a challenge to the Pope. I'm issuing a challenge to the Pope. Amen. I want my secretary, Sister uh, Meredith, amen, to put together a letter yeah. and send it to the head Catholic church here in Philadelphia uh, with my challenge towards the Pope. I think the biggest Catholic church is downtown. Mm -hmm. 
downtown. I forgot the name of it. Uh, cathedral or something. I forgot, what is it, Williams? It's a false church. I thought you would know. I, I, I don't know that one, Pastor. Amen. I don't know that one, Pastor. But uh, we, it, it's not hard to find. It's that right downtown. Amen. I want my secretary to put together a letter, and we want to emphasize to pass this on to the Pope, and we are challenging him for an open, televised discussion on any platform. I'll come to Rome. Amen. I come to Rome right in the open field. Amen. With God's word, yes. with the word of God in my hand. That's right. Like David against Goliath. That's right. And I guarantee I take the entire Roman Catholic Church and I'll remove your head. Amen. Just like David removed the head of Goliath. That's right. I guarantee it. That's right. Glory to God, hallelujah. The thing that makes me bold like this hallelujah. is God Almighty. Amen. Himself. Amen. Oh, thank God he got this thing written here. That's right. God got it written how the thing should be ordered. Yeah. And you lying imposters that hide behind a fake European religion. Yeah. Started by men. That's right. Justified by men. Amen. And sanctioned by the devil. Yeah. Telling children it's all right to have same sex. It's all right. All right. Telling young men it's all right to have same sex. That's right. Telling old men it's all right to have same sex. Amen. Amen. I want, why don't you play this? Mm -hmm. Let this be a news interruption. Why don't you do that? <laughs> That's right. Listen now. Romans 1, now we're at verse 27. Get me. And likewise also the men, leaving the natural use of the woman, yes. burned in their lusts one toward another. What is it? Men with men working that which is unseemly yes. and receiving in themselves that recompense of their error which was meet. Wait a minute. What, 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 that conduct come under what? And receiving in themselves that recompense of their error. What is it? Error. No, it's all right. Error. Pope said it's all right. Error. No, Pope Francis, the liar from Rome, said it's all right. Error. Amen. Bible says, hereby know we the spirit of truth. That's right. And the spirit of error. That's right. Read fast. And even as they did not like to retain God in their knowledge. They don't want this message. They don't want the knowledge of God. God gave them over to a reprobate mind. All right. God said you won't hear his word after he warned you. Yeah. He'll turn you over to a reprobated mind. Let you believe a lie. Let you believe what you want to believe. Let you think what you want to think. Let you feel what you want to feel as an act of rejecting God's counsel for years. To do those things which are not convenient. I told you. Man. He turn you over to a reprobated mind. That Man. mean a mind that think all the wickedness of the devil with no repentance, with That's no right. remorse, and no desire to change because you have a desire to do what you want to do and you go to hell for it. That's right. God gave them over to a reprobate mind. God gave them over to a reprobated mind. To do those things which are not to convenient. Do that which is not convenient. Being filled. Being filled. With all unrighteousness. And it's time the Pope said it's all right to do it. He's filled with what? All unrighteousness. No, he's filled with hell, Mary, the mother of God. Being filled with all unrighteousness. No, he's filled with the Holy Ghost. Being filled with all unrighteousness. Being filled with the blessed be of thy fruit of thy womb, child Jesus. Being filled with all unrighteousness. Mary, the mother of God, blessed be the fruit of thy womb, child Jesus. Being filled with all unrighteousness. Mary, the mother of God, blessed be the fruit of thy womb, child Jesus. Being filled with all unrighteousness. You fill all the beads all you want. That's you right. and your bees gonna go to hell. That's right. Hell. That's right. What? Being filled with all unrighteousness. Wait a minute. How much unrighteousness they got? All unrighteousness. They're filled with it. Filled with all oh, unrighteousness. God with all. They're filled with everything that's wrong. Fornication. Fornication. Wickedness. Covetousness. Wickedness. Covetousness. Maliciousness. Maliciousness. Full of envy. Yes. Murder, debate, deceit, malignity, whisperers. What is it? Backbiters, haters of God. Yes. Despiteful, proud, yes. boasters, inventors of evil things. Yes. Disobedient to power. What else? Without understanding, uh -huh. covenant breaker, yes. without natural affection, without natural affection, implacable, implacable, unmerciful, unmerciful, who knowing the judgment of God, you that know the judgment of God, that they which commit such things, they which do these things, are worthy of death, are worthy to die. Not only do the same, not only them that indulge, but have pleasure. But if you get pleasure in them that do, and them. there are others that do it. That's right. That's right. So, Pope, do you get pleasure? Amen. 
by seeing two men out there? My Lord. Because you say you want your priest to stop bombing the altar boys. That's, That's right. So That's being, right. That, being that you don't want to see it in St. Peter's. <laughs> Amen. You want to see it on the grounds of the street. My Lord. You're heathen. Heathen. You're nothing but a heathen and a hypocrite and a liar. That's right. 18th chapter of Revelation. I have to give much as I can. Revelation chapter 18, we're at verse 1. Get this. And after these things, I saw another angel I, come down from heaven. I saw a messenger come down from heaven. Having great power. That's what an angel is, a messenger of God. Read fast. And the earth was lightened with his glory. Yes. And he cried mightily with a strong voice, uh -huh. saying, Babylon the great is fallen. Glory to God. That's what God gave us. He gave me a strong voice. Strong voice. I'm glad God made me a strong voice preacher. That's right. Hey, Amen. I'm not tiptoeing through the toe loves in. That's uh, right. No. God oh, no. has made me a strong voice. You don't find me somewhere tiptoeing <laughs> through the toe Telling people, Tiny let, Tim, Pastor, let, let, let Tiny Tim. Say man. That's right. Let the church say man. Raise your hand and praise the Lord. That's right. Praise the Lord. <laughs> praise the Lord. Not here. Oh, no. Cried mightily with the Not here. Or in fact, God, God says, cry loud. That's right. And spare not. Spare not. Lift up your voice as a trumpet and show my people their transgression. Yeah. Thank you. God in the house of Jacob, this is. That's right. All right, son. And he, and he cried mightily with a strong he cried voice. Mightily.